Hi guys, back again. I am gonna do a little box opening. This is uh, some ball jointed doll, one third scale furniture that I ordered from uh, the attic, uh, which is uh, stuff, props and furniture made by uh, Diana Bauer. So, I hope I said that right. <laughs> but uh, I, uh, I know it's going to be, I've seen pictures of it when she was making it, um, but looking at the size of this box, I know, I know it's supposed to be one third scale, so I know it's going to be big. The other thing that she did was that she made um, a bunch of 195, 97 miniature books that go in it as well. So I thought that I would do a box opening to show that. So, oh wow, <laughs> this is so cool. I can already tell how cool it is. Get this box out of here. I threw that box down on the ground so the dogs are the dogs are now attacking it. This is kind of cool that she put all the books in already. <laughs> I was I was imagining that I was gonna have to be putting books. So I gotta be putting books in shelves forever. But it's, this is made from real wood. Uh, she, she stained it with uh, a cherry wood stain and, um, and a, I don't know what's the word that you use, um, the lacquer or the finish, the shiny stuff. I don't know what the word is for it. closer but look at that with all of those books that is so cool so it's got a little backing on it which is nice so that they don't just fall out the back this is, they're really crammed in there that's a lot of books that is a lot of books so they're a mix of um, supposed to be the classics and the witches and warlocks library so let's see I'll pull one out here this one says I can't quite read it <laughs> I think it might be in Latin or something but look at that so it's foam board but these are just perfect I mean for props they look so nice. This just looks so nice. Okay. So I just wanted to show the scale with Herla, who is my SD doll. Um, she's about 70 centimeters tall. Uh, and then little Neela, who is a Yost-sized doll. But... 
it is a really gorgeous oh we just lost the sun so my natural sunlight just went away but the wood is really gorgeous I am just in love with this lots of books it'll take Neela a long long time to get through this library she is going to be very very happy to have so many books I also wanted to show uh, this wig that I finished uh, for Herla. It's, it was my first alpaca wig. I don't think I showed it in any videos yet, but uh, it was a week or so ago that I, uh, this was my first attempt at making an alpaca wig. I haven't done much as far as wigs go at all. Uh, this is, is this my second? Like my second fiber wig. I, I guess I did make the I did make the faux fur wigs, but this is my uh, my second attempt at making hard wig cap and then actually uh, gluing them. And then the other thing that came today were my little stable mates that I ordered. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't help myself. Um, so. I think this is my favorite one. These are all, I think that all of these were Gen 2 uh, Briar stable mates, uh, little horses. And I think this one is supposed to be an Arabian. Um, this one is supposed to be a Morgan, I think. And this one is a Clydesdale. Uh, and these were the ones, basically, I just looked at, um, I knew I wanted to get a few. I looked, what were the colors I liked? What were the sculpts that I liked? I didn't really look at generation or anything, um, but um, I had to have a few. They are a little bit big in scale for Neela as far as toys go, like my scale of briar horses that I played with when I was a girl. These actually would probably be about... The size of that maybe a little bigger uh, but um, so she she's always getting little fun things so she got some horses and then the other thing that we got so this <laughs> they do make smaller ones these are called teeny winnies they are made by Briar as well and they are dang adorable. So they're very small scale. I don't think that they are made out of resin. I think the stable mates are made out of resin. This, this, they might be, these feel like um, another type of plastic. They're, they're a lighter plastic, but these are pretty, it's pretty amazing how detailed these are too. Um, they're a little, precarious with their posing like this one balances on its tail which is kind of neat um, but these are these are super tiny so here is here is Lorna I guess she's picked out her horse <laughs> uh, but I've rambled on enough thanks for watching as usual hope you're having a great Monday I'll talk to you later